good day. This is smartwatchspecifications.com, the premier site for smartwatch specs, news, and reviews. As you can see here, we have a smartwatch and our smartphone. This time, we are going to have a complete setup of the Lexus Fit Pro application. It is available on Android and iOS platform. So, we are going to have the demo of this one, of the app on the android platform so we have here our smartwatch and we have our smartphone and for those who want to see the setup the complete setup from notifications to bluetooth call to watch faces with the Lexus fit pro app watch this video okay so again this is a demo, a complete setup demo for the Lexus Fit Pro application. Step-by-step -step setup of the support app. So if you have any questions regarding the demo, just drop a comment below and we'll try to answer your queries if you do have that time. Okay, so let's start. Let's download the Lexus Fit application on the Android platform. Okay. So let's search it on Google Play Store. So let's search Lexus Fit Pro application. We have here the Lexus Fit and we also have the Lexus Fit application. So we are going to use this one. Okay, so tap on the Lexus Fit Pro. It is just 39 MB as you can see here with over 500,000 downloads. Tap on install. Let's wait. Okay, we are on 97% and it's done downloading. It's now installing the Lexus Fit Pro application. So it's finished. So let's try to open the app. So we have here user protocol and privacy protocol. Just agree. We have here our first permission allow Lexus Fit Pro to access this device's location while using the app. Only this time don't allow. Okay, we'll choose this one. So we have here the UI of the Lexus Fit Pro application. We have the home device motion and mine so to add your smartwatch go to the device option okay so we have here some of the settings of the smartwatch you can set this once we or once you paired your smartwatch with the support app so go bind and we have here another permission allow Lexus fit pro to find connect to and determine the relative position of nearby devices allow okay, it's now searching for our smartwatch okay so we have a lot of options here so let's make it sure that we are choosing or we are pairing the exact smartwatch or our smartwatch go to more section about and we have here the name watch okay with our mac address so watch 8746 okay so this is the one to tap to pair it with a smart watch tap on the watch okay bluetooth base connection completed time setting completed user profile setting completed as you can see here our watch face here changes upon connecting with the support app so we are now connected as you can see here okay bluetooth pairing quest pair this one for our bluetooth k okay, call pair okay dial settings let's see let's check on our smartwatch are we really connected yes we are connected okay so let's have first the push notifications tap on the message push let's activate 
Okay, some of the apps here. SMS reminder. Set successfully as you can see here. WeChat reminder. So it needs notification read permission first. Okay, just look for the Laxa Speed Pro application. So we have it here. Activate it. Okay, you need to activate this one to be able to read and receive notifications as you can see here. Okay, allow. Okay, then go back. Okay, choose the application where you want to receive notifications. Okay, we have WhatsApp here, Instagram. Let's also activate Facebook. Okay. If you have a if you have a line, you can also activate it. In our case, we don't have it, so we will not activate some of the apps here. Go back. Okay, so we are done with the message notifications. Okay, let's check for other settings here. Vibration settings. We have dial settings. Frequent contacts. Let's try to add one on our smartwatch. Okay, so let's see. Let's set first our menu here. Style 2, phone book. We don't have any contacts here. So tap on to add contacts. Okay. Tap on the plus sign. Add contact. You can add the name here or you can browse the phone book. Allow Lexus Speed Pro to access your contacts. Allow it. So let's add this one. Okay and okay it is now committing set successfully go back so let's see okay phone book and we have here our contacts okay if you want to call this one you can do it okay as long as you are paired with a support app okay so seems like everything is okay here let's go now with the Race to wake. Let's see if this thing is activated. It's not. Okay, activate it if you want to check for the time whenever you risk your when whenever you lift your wrist like this. Okay. Go back. Then Okay, there's no option for the time. Let's see. Okay, none. Let's go with the dial settings. And let's try to download e-watch face for our smartwatch. Okay, let's have this one. Okay, machine dial number three. Tap on install. It is now loading. Let's wait for the installation of the watch face on our smartwatch. The loading okay got it okay our smartwatch here as you can see switch to download mode okay it's now installing or downloading the watch face on our smartwatch okay so we are almost done here let's see if we'll have a successful download so our smartwatch here restarted and as you can see we have our new watch face a machine dial category watch face okay as you can see we don't have any issues at all when downloading the watch face again we already set okay almost everything here if you want to add an alarm you can tap on the alarm okay add one then you can set the time here so it is military standard time here 22 23 every Tuesday okay, then confirm okay, it's now committing so we have the here an alarm it works with Monday Wednesday and Friday okay and go back what else do we have here dial settings reset remove over the air upgrade background settings so we already set the notification so Reminder, yes, set. 
So, sedentary reminder, this is for you to alert you when you are sitting for too long. Okay, you can also set it here if you like the functionality. Okay, so that's it. Everything is okay. As you can see here, the smartwatch is still using the military standard time. Seems like, if I'm not mistaken, seems like there's no option for this to change it to 12 hours standard. 12 hours standby time. Or 12 hour format time, I mean. So let's see here. Okay, do we have it here? No. We don't have the option. Okay. So hopefully we'll add it here on the support app. Okay, when they upgrade the application. But so far, everything works. We have the message notification, alarm, sedentary reminder, race to wake, frequent contacts we were able to add, dial settings we were, we were able to download the watch face, and that's it. So if you have any questions regarding the complete setup for our smartwatch or any other smartwatch that uses the Laksa Speed Pro application, just drop a comment below and we will try to answer your queries if we do have that time. Bye!